Hi, I'm Tannis Winslow, the Director of Visual Arts and Family Programming for Art Park and Company, a 501c3 charitable, not-for-profit organization providing the programming within the New York State Park. Our mission is to take the finest in performing and visual art and make them accessible to everybody. Our park seeks to foster an understanding and awareness of the many and varied forms of art and art makers. Since its inception, it has served as an active prototype for truly public art. This is our park in 1979. Remember when the community would come together to create art experiences? Remember the art owl? Remember workshops on the art owl? Remember creating with your children, family, friends, and neighbors? Remember? Remember Art Park Repertory Theater? Remember the storytelling place? Remember the painted parking lot? In the summer of 1979, artist Jean Davis, whose estate is held by the Smithsonian American Art Museum, installed an artwork at Art Park titled Niagara. 1979. We came to know it as the painted parking lot and it was incredible. Jean Davis spent weeks hand rolling 60, 364 foot long lines in the hot summer sun and everyone came out to see it. Niagara 1979 was widely covered by the media. At over 40,000 square feet, the Guinness Book of World Records recognized it as the largest painting in the world. This is what that parking lot looks like today. But what if we could turn this back into this? Our park is launching a campaign for the summer of 2017 to bring back Niagara, 1979, or as it came to be known, the painted parking lot, and we need your help. What makes this artwork so amazing is the fact that it's created in a non-traditional space, a parking lot, which offers viewers and visitors the opportunity to experience art in a completely different perspective. Because we are not-for-profit, all of our funding goes towards bringing free or greatly reduced programming to the community. And now, we need you, the community, to help us bring a truly incredible piece of artwork to you. I remember the Painted Parking Lot project from when I was a kid, when my mom would bring myself, my sister, the neighborhood kids to our park during the summer. Seeing the Painted Parking Lot was the first spark of excitement. It was the, both the first and last memory of the day. I'm so excited to hear that our park's trying to bring back this project. I'm doing everything I can to help support it, and I hope you will